number two guys. So today I decided to take you to the boxing class. We're gonna do a private session today. Uh, I do it at least twice a week now. It's a good cardio, it's a different type of workout. I've been training for years, so I like to mix up what I do. I do four times a week the gym, and then I'm gonna combine it with boxing and uh, hiking and other stuff just for fun. So in the morning of the boxing, I'm gonna wake up like two hours prior to the training to make sure my body gets time to um, wake up. I'm gonna drink some water. I'm gonna have a protein shake with a little bit of fruit and MCT oil. I don't wanna be like eating anything because I don't feel good if I box like that, but I wanna have a little something and the MCT oil is gonna keep my body just fired up for the workout. So around an hour, an hour 15 before the workout, I drink this and I feel great for the workout. Now I'm just gonna wrap up and I'm gonna get this workout started. Hitting the bag is easy, but moving and being fluid, like fluid when you do it, that's what we're working so today. From the ground up, yep, ground up, right? So first drill we're gonna do here on, on the ladder, we'll work laterally. Uh, you're gonna use each box, and you're gonna step into each box, but you move out, move over, move in, right? So you're starting your stance here, coming forward, just a hard step in. Don't push and leave that back foot. Just step in, move back. You're gonna move over, align to the next box, move in, take a laser straight out, straight back. There you go. Keep that big toe down on the back. Stay grounded. Pump. Pull that right shoulder a little bit from the throw. There you go. You're stepping in, jabbing here, stepping forward to the right. And really rotate through that hip. Straight down the middle, straight down the pipe. Back down the line. Nice. Really good. Straight out, straight back. And yeah. Sorry, you're gonna Stay loose, stay loose, don't get warmed up a little bit. Double jab, two. two. <coughs> First jab's gonna be out of the box. Second jab, you're gonna step in the hole, bringing the right hand through with the foot, back out. One, one, two, back out, right? Step, step, throw, good. Fire that right hand. rotation, screwing those feet into the floor, and as you step left, you're gonna roll, right? Two, hook, roll under. Two, hook, roll under. Punching hard is not the key. Speed and avoiding to get punched. Kevin is going easy on me. <laughs> well, we're still, warm, we're still warming up a little bit. It's a slow, steady escalation. It's getting better every day. Absolutely. It's good training, guys. Two, three times a week. I mean, it really depends on, on, on what else you do. You, know? you, you, yeah. you weight train four times instead of a week. Yeah. But I gotta come a little more to even right, more right, speed yeah, yeah. Shit. yeah. Exactly. Like even just on the back and stuff. Yeah, just practice some rhythm, tempo, all that stuff. I'm getting loose and I feel it. That's it, for sure. Yeah. One. Give it a shot, number one. It's, it's intimidating walking into a place like, like this or any boxing gym, but there's a lot of people out there doing it now. Just, you gotta be, just kinda get rid of that nervousness and get in, start, and you're gonna, you know. Every, I've been doing this for 10 years now. Everybody that comes in here, no one has a bad time. They always enjoy it, they always have fun, they always learn something. 
and they want to keep coming back because you are learning something. So number one is just get started. Give it a shot um, and find a good trainer or trainers. Uh, and, and like we spoke about in the beginning, it's from the ground up. Feet, footwork, where your feet are, feet, uh, foot positioning, that's the most important, right? And be patient, it's not easy. They do at home to get started. Uh, jump rope, yeah. The reason why jumping rope and boxing is so important is it really teaches you to, to stay loose, stay relaxed, be light on your feet. So then it really does translate well into here. But there's tons of content out there on, on YouTube and on our Instagram. We've got tons of technique videos on there. And again, just start from the ground up. Get the build the foundation. Move forward. Get your footwork down. Punches come second. Um, but yeah, at home is, is jumping rope. Just drill those basics. There's tons of workouts out there at home, you know. So that's one thing about COVID is everyone started putting tons of workout <laughs> content out there. Yeah. So there's tons of it. And, and again, it's just finding a place to start, give it a shot, and going. Same as training, guys. Honestly, I'd rather hire someone that's been doing it for a while privately and learn from it. Like you can do on my app with workout, like stuff like that. That's the best way to do it. Yeah. You get someone that know what he's talking about, and you get the best. Yeah. If you got a trainer that will actually <coughs> coach you too and teach you the basics, then you've got something you can go home and work on too. So you don't have to come into the gym five days a week, two, two, three times and work on the rest of your own. Jack. One, two. Jab, jab. Real, real short, nice and easy. Basic combos. One, two punches. Working on getting out, either to the side or straight out, right? So you're going to move in, boom, boom, move straight out. Right, always think, once you're done with your offense, you gotta think defense. So get out, right, you're done. Boom, boom, you can move over to the side. You pivot through, pivot off to the left, but always move. Good. So side to side, in and out. Think about you got this guy side to side. Side to side. In and out, you know where we in and out. You know that. <laughs> Finish left, move left, right? If you finish right, move, move right. to your right, okay? So it sets that weight transfer up, boom, boom, off the side, moving around, move right, all right? So again, side to side. Once you angle off, keep that movement going, right? takes what, what you tell them and, and, and applies it right away because obviously you get better and better every session. So that's the guy here. <coughs> so what was the weak point of the session? The weak point? I don't think there's a weak point. I think there's 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 things to work on. Uh, the back leg. Uh, that, that, that foot, I think, when you throw in that jab, it's, it's still leaving the floor a little bit. You want to keep that grounded, right? Because again, what's going to happen, you're going to overcommit to that lead leg. And it's going to make it hard to move back when you need to. So. I think that's the main focus, especially for our next session. Got it, guys. Find what you like. Not as good as the rest and improving. It's only been five sessions that we're working. It's the fifth one today. So uh, it's just the beginning. We're going to see next time we do a vlog. How did I improve? It'll definitely be improved, for sure.